briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1997, the United States Court of Appeals for the Ninth Circuit heard a case called Schaefer v. Las Vegas Hilton Corp. in Re Video Depot Limited, which focused on whether the Las Vegas Hilton was the first person to receive the money. The situation began in 1990 when Video Depot's principal, Jeffrey R. Lynn, owed the Las Vegas Hilton $225,000 in gambling debts. Video Depot purchased a $65,000 cashier's check payable to Hilton to partially satisfy the debt. However, Video Depot's trustee later filed a fraudulent conveyance action against Hilton to recover the proceeds of the check. The main question was whether Hilton was the initial transferee of the fraudulent transfer. Arlin had a permanent line of credit with Hilton, and he had never before presented a Video Depot purchase check to cover his gambling losses. The district court affirmed the bankruptcy court's judgment in favor of the trustee. The court held that legal control over funds could be established by directing a transfer, but in this case, Video Depot purchased a cashier's check payable to Hilton, thus transferring control directly to Hilton. The court dismissed Hilton's argument on payment form and upheld the bankruptcy court's decision identifying Hilton as an initial transferee under Section 550. A. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit LSD.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.